let's talk a little bit about negativity. Now, there is a thing called negativity bias, and it's an actual fact that we often remember negative things that happen to us more often than when we remember positive things. And we can attach that to things. We can attach it to situations. If we're maybe got bit by a dog once, every time we see a dog, we're nervous. Not all dogs are bad. We know that, but in our mind, we remember the negative times more than the times we met really great dogs and we played with them and we had a wonderful time. Sometimes we do that with people. We see people respond to things in a way that maybe isn't pleasant to us, and we remember that one thing. I tell a story quite often about a person that I saw at a conference once. He was young, he was arrogant, he was kind of a jerk. And I stuck with that for a very long time. Every time I saw his name, what I remembered was, wow, that person's really a jerk. And then again, I met him and we had a conversation and I thought, wow, this guy's really smart. He's intelligent. He's present. I was pretty impressed. But for years, I had not given him his full value. So I think it's really important that we recognize our negativity bias. So what I'd like you to do is just think as you go through the day, is my negativity bias affecting me? And if it is, check yourself. Are you being fully present in the now instead of in the past? This is a way for you to start to deal with that negativity bias and approach everything with what could be called a beginner's mind that we're really going to approach things with, okay, it's a new day, we're gonna start over and allow people and things to be what they really are as opposed to what we remember they might be. Maybe we don't even remember it the way it was.